Good morning, everybody. Happy Thursday. I'm so happy to see you guys again. I hope that everyone's doing well and is having a great morning or afternoon. So we are back here at my house for circle time and we're gonna guess what month it is. I bet you guys know it. It's April. Good job. Clap it out with me. April, April, April. Girl, nice work. Can you guys help me sing the month song? Volume up. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, and August, September, October, November, December. Then we start all over. Great work. Alrighty guys, so today is Thursday. Sing it with me. Today is Thursday, today is Thursday, all day long, all day long. Yesterday was Wednesday, tomorrow will be Friday. Let's have some fun, let's have some fun. Good job, all right guys, so today is Thursday. Are there any other days of the week? Yes, days of the week, days of the week. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. Good job. All right, guys, so we solved some mysteries. We know what day of the week it is. We know what month it is. And now we've got to figure out two other mysteries. We have our number mystery and our color pattern mystery. Our number mystery and our color pattern mystery won't be hard to figure out because we only have one day so far. So let's start with our number mystery. Turn your volume up. One, two, good job. We have, this is a two color pattern, so the first color we use is blue, and the second is yellow. Great work, guys. Perfection. It's a yellow, too. Amazing. So we're going to put that up. Today, guys, is Thursday, April 2nd, 2020. And we are going to say our pledge now because we did it in the beginning of the video. So if everybody wants to stand up, I'll get our flag out. You can put your hand on your heart. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Great work. Guys, we just said the pledge to our country. What country is it that we live in? It's? America! Great work. Oh, look, it's upside down. Whoops. <laughs> there we go. All right, guys, who is the president of the United States of America? It's Donald Trump. Great job. What number president is he? Good job. He's 45. 45 looks like a four and a five. Very cool. Nice work, guys. The president, where does he live? That's right, he lives in the White House. Very good. Now the President and the White House are located in Washington, D.C. But do we live in Washington, D.C.? No. What state do we live in? That's right, Maryland. Can you guys help me find Maryland on the map? Can you find Maryland? Can you find Maryland on the map? On the map? I know you can find Maryland. I know you can find Maryland just like that. Just like that. <gasps> I'll help you. Good job. Can you guys help me point to Maryland on the map? Nice work. You guys are so smart. I miss you so much. So what I wanted to work on today, guys, was doing some number tracing in the air. So can you find your pointer finger for me? <gasps> Boop. When you found your pointy finger, touch your nose with it. <gasps> now touch your head. <gasps> now touch your ear. Now touch your lips. <gasps> Good job. 
So let's trace some numbers in the air. Okay, let's start with the number one. Line straight down just for fun. That's the way we make a one. Good job, guys. Boop, just like that. All right, now let's, let's do the number two. Around and down and over to you. That's the way you make a two. Can you guys practice that with me? Ooh, boop. Good job. Let's practice the number three. Finger pointers out. Around the tree, around the tree. That's the way you make a three. Good job, guys. All right, let's try number four. <clears throat> down and around and down some more. That's the way you make a four. Good work, guys. One more number. We're going to do our number five. Can you guys help me do the number five? All right, get that pointer finger up. Touch your nose one more time. Here we go. Down around and take a drive. That's the way you make a five. Great work, guys. Keep practicing writing your numbers in the air. And you can use your hands to grab a pencil or some markers and practice writing those numbers on paper. I miss you guys so much. I can't wait to see you again. I'll see everyone tomorrow. Mwah!